Hi, this is Eric Russell from Ambitious Cycle, and today we're going to show you how to install a Givi or a Kappa mono lock case on the back of your Suzuki V Strong, whether it's a 650 or 1000, with the stock Suzuki luggage rack. So, all of the Givi or Kappa mono lock cases include this universal mounting plate. It uses a simple little grid work here on the bottom that allows you to attach this to virtually any rear rack that's on a bike. Uh, remember, this is for the mono lock cases and not the mono key cases. In order to utilize this grid work, we're going to use this center hole and these two rear outside holes, and we're going to line it up and attach the case onto that rear rack. What they have given you are these square washers, this long bolt here, a nylon lock nut, and a few other washers, as well as these plates. We are only going to use two thirds of this kit, so we only need three of each nut, washer, and clip here. So what we do here, as you can see, these washers fit nicely into the grid work really easily, which allows us to lock this grid work down onto this top plate. So we're gonna thread some bolts through. And this is essentially what we'll end up with. Again, I'm just putting the washer on. Now, we're going to use these clips here that were included in the kit and attach those underneath the rear rack. So, we're going to use these installed clips. I'm going to attach it right underneath my aluminum rear rack here. It actually is fairly simple to do. Again, I'm using another washer and my nylon lock nut. And with a little bit of help here, That is in the loose position right now. Once all three of these are tightened down, is just install this little cover plate. I'll just clip it in quickly for your video here. And there's two small screws included that just help secure that cover plate. So I'm gonna install this Kappa K35 NT. All the NT means versus the N is that it has these clear reflectors instead of red reflectors, slightly different coloring. All we have to do is take these two feet in the bottom, they slide in these two slots. So I just tilt the case, set it in, push this little black button right here at the front until I hear a good solid clip that's locked in. Turn, remove the key. Simple as that. We have a top box for a helmet installed on a Suzuki V-Strong.